My name is Andrew Wilson. I'm the Access Services Librarian in the Ida Kuhn Loeb Music Library, and our project is called QR Codes in the Library. The idea is that we're posting QR codes, which are the two-dimensional barcodes that you see just about everywhere these days, particularly in marketing, uh, into relevant area of the stacks that would link users uh, with a smartphone or a tablet computer directly to research guides relevant to those areas of the stacks. We wanted to be able to link our physical library space with our virtual space. And so in the music library, we were going to uh, go ahead and, and link to some of our research guides. We uh, did the research and the various setup required registering, creating the QR codes, uh, testing tracking using Google Analytics so that we get good data. Uh, and then we implemented by physically posting the codes in the stacks right on September 1st, which was the first day of classes. The the second main phase, of course, is the uh, uh, running of, of the trial, having the codes there and then being able to uh, uh, monitor them using Google Analytics. The third and final phase will come at the end of the semester when we will collate our data and uh, we'll put together a best practices guide uh, that can be used across any of the Harvard Library units if they would like to do a QR code project themselves. We've posted the QR code on how to find reviews and serials in the area of the serial stacks. So if somebody is there just to uh, you know, start poking around in our serials and they don't know how to find specific reviews within these serials, they can scan the QR code, be taken straight to the research guide, and uh, have all that material right at their fingertips. The three different research guides that we're using actually uh, appeal to uh, three broad categories of, of our users. We have the uh, finding concert reviews in periodicals. That's really geared towards concentrators uh, in the music department, perhaps even graduate students. We also have a jazz research guide that we've linked to, and that's going to be very attractive, I think, to non-concentrated undergraduates who are going to be coming in, perhaps, to the music library for the very first time. Uh, they may never take another music course again. The other category is perhaps uh, something even broader to the broader Harvard constituency that uses our library. And that is a research guide on how to find songs within song collections. I think this is going to be extremely helpful just to folks who want to find a, an American song or a popular song out there that may be in one of our collections and might otherwise be a little bit more difficult to discover just simply using Hollis. This is an example of one of the signs that we've posted with the QR codes on it. You can see that it links to the research guide, finding concert reviews and periodicals. My request was for $50 for magnetic sign holders. So this is, this is a, a low to no budget project. This is the app available for free from the App Store, and it's called Crafter. And you can see that it employs the camera on either a smartphone or a tablet computer. And you simply put the QR code into the camera window, and it takes you automatically to any URL that you link to. And in this case, it's our research guide, Finding Concert Reviews. And you can see the, that there's a, a welcome screen, there's uh, a number of uh, different online resources available. The name of the author and one of our research uh, and reference librarians, Liza Vick, is there so that students can contact her for assistance. And there's even a feedback screen. So I'm very pleased that uh, using uh, this QR code project, we can provide perhaps a little more exposure for these resources.